everyone, and welcome to this week's episode of Eat, Crit, and Survive Plays a Board Game, where some, well, a couple has gathered around the table to play a board game together. Yay, the audio is working. I just have to, uh, I've left the spirit level you, on the camera. <laughs> you have left the spirit level on the camera. Do you know what, I'm going to leave it there, because that's what's happening. Hello everyone, my name is Luke, that is Laura. Who will Hi. say hello in a second. Thank you very much, she's just making sure that everything's working. Our sound didn't work last time, so we're making sure it works. Time. Making sure we're testing. Anything's everything. not working, please tell us because we're still learning. We're still trying to make this work. We're doing different things, but we are around a table today. We are playing a one of our favourites. Um, this is definitely one of your favourites because it's one of the ones you've got in your top ten. We are playing Disney Villainous today. Yours. Um, it's been a little while since we've actually been able to sit down and stream a game for you guys and uh, and to sort of sit, chill, hang out. Yeah, it has been Place a while, hasn't it? Life and stuff. Life and stuff. We've uh, we've had a few things going on. We went to Aircon over in Harrogate. That was right. That was a lot of good fun. Got to hang out with some of the people from what we played, and a few various people in the board game community, which is always really nice and fun to do. Um, yeah, we've just been busy. <laughs> and then we came back from Aircon, and we were just tired. Oh, and sick. it's like you wouldn't think that sitting and playing board games for. Th- Four days straight would tire you out, but it really does. And yet, we also yet. both got sick in different variations, so that doesn't help. Oh, we don't. That's what happens when you put like three thousand people in a room together. Mm. Someone's going to come out with the gold. Probably. Um, would yeah. recommend. Would recommend. Aircon is great. We will hopefully be there again next year. We'll see. Um, but for now, we're going to play. Game. We're going to play Villainous, Disney Villainous. We are playing specifically with the original base set, which has uh, six characters contained within it. And I am playing with a character from the Bigger and Badder expansion, which contains within it Syndrome, which you can see from The Incredibles, Lotso from uh, Toy Story, and Madame Mim, who I am playing with today. You didn't explain who was in this one. I'm getting to that. Well... No, well, I'm going to talk about it. What? Play the base game. As you can see, it has the lovely Maleficent on the front, and that is who I will be playing as today. This also contains Captain Hook, yes. Jafar, the Queen of Hearts, mm-hmm. Ursula, Prince John, and... That's all six. I only counted for... Oh, six, because Maleficent. <laughs> there you go. This is a good sign for me. Yeah, I can count. <laughs> Um, so some OG characters in this one, and then yes, there's been oh, what's five other expansions. We have three, three of others. them, and there are five. Yeah, um, nice. yeah. We need to get the other two at some point. Good. But then we've got we've got the one with the evil queen, Isma, Doctor Persilie, um, Scar, Ratigan. And it's wicked to the wicked to the core. Evil comes prepared, and we are back. Oh, there's an one or the two forgotten. I don't know. Hey, comment in the chat. And just let us know which one we've forgotten. Let us know which one we mean. So yeah, that uh, we have. There are two other boxes with like Gaston. We, we don't have Gas- and Cruella. Yeah, we don't have Gaston or Cruella de Vil. We do. Uh, like you said, we have uh, Hades. 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 That was my guy. Good old. Hades. Wasn't from the chat. Sorry. No, it was me. Um, but yeah, so we are going to be playing today. I'm going to be playing as the delectable Madame Mim, whose uh, looks, whose mi- little figurine looks a little it's bit like, like a troll. It does. Like look, a troll. I mean, to be fair, she does look like a troll. She is a troll, basically. She is a troll, and you're playing with Maleficent. Oh, Maleficent, which is like this lovely. Do you know what this, you know this Mim thing looks like? It looks like she is. You know, one of those things that you press down and you just uh, they bounce. After a while, she's got that shape. Just oh, a, was it like a pog? It was like a pog, pog. thing. And you just sort of press it down and it would Yeah, boom. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. Okay. I get it. Um, but if you are not familiar with Villainous, we are basically two just Disney or, or Pixar villains now, with the Big Bang Matter set bringing in Pixar mm-hmm. into the world. Yeah. We're playing as the different villains and uh, competing against each other to in our own do realms, our... to take over our realms and defeat the heroes and be the victorious villains that they were always meant to be. And we have our own specific goals that we are going for. So mine, as Mad Mim, is I am going to try and defeat all of Merlin's transformations. So in, for my specific play, I have two fake decks. Uh, normally you only have... Fate. I thought we said fake then. It's fake. Just in case you were wondering. 
fatty decks. Fatty decks. Uh, we have normally you have one fatty deck, um, which you can, which will be used which as your heroes that will be uh, targeted mine. by your opponents. That is Laura's with the lovely art behind. You can't see the artwork; it's a bit brushed. It's a bit brushed out. That's okay. Madam Mim, on the other hand, has two fate decks: one for herself and one for Merlin. Um, the Madam Mim fate deck will come into play if Laura targets me with a fate action, and I say if. When? Um, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. It always happens. But the Merlin transformations, they will come out as part of my goal. So at the moment, we have Goat Merlin in my realm, pottering around being a goat. And my goal is I have to defeat all of her... Uh, his. All of, all of his enemy, All of his transformations by playing out Madame Mim's own specific transformations and using them to defeat it. So I can only defeat the goat with a purple dragon. Because, of course... Um, and the rules. Normally, these heroes, as they will come out, transformations in this case, but they are heroes for everyone, for all other states, uh, case and purposes, can be put out into different parts of the round, and they will block off different actions that we have available on our board. So normally, these boards have two halves that are available, and they have about four actions usually that flippy, are playable. Flippy, 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 flippy. <laughs> it folds out. Um, but you can cover up the top half, which can reduce the amount of actions that you can take. Um, those actions are... In fact, I'm going to bring my board up a little bit. We haven't talked about what my aim is. That's true. I was going to talk about the game in general. And then it got but you get distracted and then you forget that I'm going to... Play. My thing is to start your turn with a curse at each location. Mm -hmm. hmm. So in Maleficent's main deck there are going to be four different curses that she's going to have to be there's actually out. three i'll have two over the same one two, uh, one over the same two. Four. no four. there's only three yeah fair enough um but yeah so each of these locations she will have to play a curse out to the way that we're going to do that is we're going to have different actions that we're going to undertake they are gain power which will just gain us a number of power equal to these things out of the cauldron this cauldron comes with the base game uh, each of the smaller expansions does come with a number of power for you to play oh, with. Each of the expansions are their own little game. You do not need this one. No, you if you just... don't like any of the villains in here, but heck, you like Lotso because he smells like strawberries, then you can just go for the one expansion and everything that you want, that you need to play. Apart from this nice cauldron, you don't get a cauldron with the expansion, but you do get the power tokens, you, you get everything that you need to play. So don't worry if you don't have this one. You go and go be Lotso. Live your dreams. <laughs> exactly. Uh, so the different actions you have, you have gain power, which will gain you a number of power, as shown in the number in the action space. There is play a card, which will, some of the cards will have basically cards from our own hand. They will have like a power value, which will be their cost or a cost value. Um, in order to play, and then we do their effects. Some of those will be allies, some will be effects, which will, allies will come out into our realm and they will just sort of hang out until we need to utilize them for some things. Start straight now. Oh, I'm sorry. It's not gonna be straight when we start, but at least I'm gonna start with some sort of, oh, this just makes me. Ah, uh, it's not straight. Carry the, on. The camera's not exactly straight, so that's probably Carry not perpendicular, but that's okay. Um, so we have got uh, allies which will be put out into the realm and they will do their various things. You don't need the lock token, that can go away. Um, we will have effects which will just be one time use abilities before they go into our discard pile. Or we're going to be organising things until the cows come home. There we go. Carry mm. on. Uh, we have a discard action, in which case you can discard any number of cards from your hand, and then at the end of your turn you will draw back up. There is an activate action, which I don't think either of us have on our... No, no. It's, it's, so some, it's specific to some Some characters villains. will have them, because some of them will have abilities like items, like in uh, Jafar, like Jafar has you some. can um, activate Iago with it. Um, you can also activate the hypnotizing staff, if yep. that's what it's actually called. But yeah, some villains have Alan, Alans? <laughs> Alans. Allies or <laughs> items. They don't have any Alans. Any allies or items that can activate. If anyone out there knows of a Disney villain that has an Alan that they could have, let us know. Um, but yeah, there's that. We also have move uh, items or allies and move heroes. They have two slightly different actions. Sort of. Because it's a little hard to see these on the camera with the uh, zoom out and the positioning of it, we're going to sort of talk about each action as they come up. Yes. Um, and then the probably the most important actions we have are the vanquish action, in which your allies can attack heroes that are in your realm that your opponent has Fight. placed there. Um, which, in the case of some heroes, is quite significant. Like with, uh, let's pick a hero that needs to be defeated, like um, 
The Evil Queen, she has to defeat Snow White. So you have to find Snow White in the Fate deck and defeat her uh, using poison. I mean, you can defeat all the... You know, every, all the villains can defeat all the heroes. I, oh. I played Jafar the other day and I had Aladdin, I had a Boo out, I had... Oh, I can't remember who else I had out. I think I had Raja out. Oh, you had the Genie. Genie out. And you just have to defy them. But that not isn't necessarily your aim. No, that isn't necessarily the objective. And then, of course, there is the Fate action, in which you will draw two cards from your opponent's Fate deck, have a look at them, pick one, and play it into their run. It's either going to be a hero, which will cover up half of their board, as we were saying earlier, or it will just be a general effect and ability that will trigger and smite things, make things annoying. Get in the way gently. Smitey. Smitey, smitey, smitey. All right, so uh, I guess that's all we need to do. We need to draw four cards to mm-hmm. start off into our hands. This will be very interesting. Uh, then we need to decide who's going first. The first player gets a single power to begin, so we're going to use the Chonka D20. Chonka D20. I rolled an 11. Why did you roll it into there? Good lord. Three. Classic. That's about right. That's how life works. We'll see how we go. And uh, we go from here. So you gain... Oh, the name of this card makes me so happy. You gain a power to start... You gain a power. You gain a power. Uh, mm. Right. I've got some Unfortunately, I mean, you can, you can kind of look at our cards, but at the same time, you can't look at my cards. <laughs> I'm going to go into the woods. Into the woods! And I will draw two power uh, to start things off. I can play a card. So I'm going to play Fox Mim for two power. So Fox Mim, uh, the ability is that... I'll bring it up here for you guys to see. Ta-da! Fox Mim has the ability that will give the location a vanquish action. Uh, and it can only be used to vanquish when targeting Rabbit Merlin. So that's the kind of trade-off I have there. But she is in play, so that you know that's cool. Um, then I can move a character if I want to. Um, I can fate you, so I'm going to fate you right off the bat. Well, that's useless. <laughs> Both of the cards were the Sword of Truth, which is an item that can be equipped to a hero. You have no heroes out, so that's kind of relevant. So I'm going to draw a card at the end of my turn, draw back up to four, and end my turn there. Oh, okay. You're up. Awesome. That worked out well for me. Okay. I'm going to go down here. I'm going to stock up on three power. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. And then I can discard. Good. Well, I don't think I'm going to. Instead, I'm going to play, and I'm going to just play just because I can. Why not? Cackling Goon! Because it <laughs> honestly makes me, um, that name just makes me laugh. That's fair. So, Cackling Goon gets a plus one strength for each hero at his location. At the moment, he's only got one strength. So... Really? I could have done with a hero coming out. It would have been useful, yeah. At least he's out now. (laughs) So that's my three collected. I didn't want to discard. I've played one. You have a second play card. I do have a second play card. Over in the forest. And then you know what? I'm going to play for zero power. Vanish. Hmm. On my next turn, I do not have to move to a new location. That's pretty good. I can stay where I want to. So normally in your turn, you're going to be moving around two different locations on your board to You can't do stay the in the things. same one. Yes. However, you that... have to move to somewhere new, apart from me, because I'm special. Because you're vanished. All right. And then I'm done, so then at the end of my turn, I draw to four cards. All right. I am moving to Madame Min's cottage. This lets me draw, uh, gain two power again. Play a card. I'm going to be playing Purple Dragon Mim. Uh, I can move a hero and I can move an ally if I so choose. But I'm not going to. Instead, I am well, not at this exact moment. I'm going to use the Vanquish action on Fox Mim to have Purple Dragon Mim eat Goat Merlin. Can you do that? Mm hmm. Because it's a Vanquish action. You don't have to vanquish in the same location. Oh! Oh, right. 
Sorry, I thought it was like an activate, and I was like, how can you just No, it's just a, it's yeah, just a vanquish. I get you. So, nom, I have defeated... Bye, Goat Merlin. Goat Merlin. So I am just trying to get goat, uh, this deck empty from with all the various transformations. When a uh, villain is a hit, the ally is used to defeat a hero, it also gets discarded. And the power has to equal or exceed. In the bottom right-hand corner of the cards, they have a strength. Sorry, the bottom left, they have a strength value. Nice. And they turn off. Um, however, because Merlin is defeated, one of my things is I have to bring out a new Merlin transformation each time. We now have Crab Merlin, <laughs> who can only be defeated by Rhinoceros Merlin. So no, no, no rhin Rhinoceros Min. Min. Oh, God. Too many M names. <laughs> do you know what? I've never seen the Sword in the Stone. Why in hell are you playing it? You do not understand this whatsoever. I do understand references. I've seen, I've I've seen like scenes, but I don't oh. know. Because in the film, they have a wizard the, the animals, the animals that are pitted, are the ones that actually yeah. fight in the film. Yeah. Yeah, no, I got that. Okay. Uh, and then I draw a card to turn my turn. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Right. I reached into the next. I really wanted to fight you. However, um, mm -hmm. but I've done it, so I will keep it. So I will just take another three power stock up on that power. Let's get some Much power. power. Um, I will then, I am going to discard, which means that I can then pick more up. Good way if you mm -hmm. want to get through your deck, if you're looking for a specific item, then sometimes just going for a discard and just getting rid of stuff, especially at the beginning of the game, because you'll have things like this can be used against heroes, boost your strength with extra items. Like, I don't have any at that moment. Let's get rid of it until I find the thing that I want and then I've got a game plan. At least that's how I play it anyway. You could probably play it better. Um, so I collected three. I've discarded. And then I'll play. I will play for three power. Raven. Before Maleficent moves, you may move Raven to any location and perform one available action at his new location. Mm -hmm. Apart from fate actions. That's pretty powerful. Mm. And then... It's a good way to gain power. I am done. <laughs> that was anticlimactic. Fair enough. I'm not going to play it again because I don't want to. Fair enough. All right. I am going to move back to the woods, gain myself two power. I will... Play... I'm not cheating. I look at the top two cards of the Merlin Transformation deck and return them in any order. <laughs> right, so well you can go on top. Basically, the way that they were. Um, oh, nice. And then I fix you. Ah. Oh. Oh. this one but I will play King Hubert King Hubert King Hubert is played you may move one ally from each adjacent location to his location so I'm going to just okay. shift the ribbon oh, okay. the ribbon going to scuttle along and hang out with King Hubert that's okay well Captain Goon now has uh, two extra power two strength that's true but not enough to defeat King Hubert not three. yet um, and I can't do anything else, so I shall draw an card. An card. Mm -hmm. Done? Apparently. Well, okie dokie. I'm going to go... Where am I going to go? Oh, actually, so, before I move, I can move my raven to any location mm. and take an action. Ah, oh, forgot you can't do fate. Oh, well. Um, Stay alive. What would I like to do? What would I like to do? Um, let's. Okay, let's go here. And I'm going to perform the discard action. So oh. I'll get rid of these. And then I will move. And I'm going to go. Hmm. I'm going to go down here. To the Forbidden Mountains. Forbidden Mountains, where I got one power. Yes. I will. 
Mm. I will. <laughs> Tension is rising. Oh, it's where I've got power. Do I want to play? Yes, no, yeah, no, yeah, no. No, I'm not gonna play, I'm gonna wait. Um, move. Um, move. I mean, Raven moves anywhere he wants to, really. No, I'll keep Captain Goon there. Um, and then, we'll fate you. All right, draw two from the Madam Moon Fate deck. Fatey, fatey. Hmm. Oh, okay, well, I've done the classic thing and also got two of the same. Yeah. My fate deck is tiny in comparison because I've got two of them, so... Yeah. Um, yeah, I'll play that. Sure. Okay. Uh, it was knowledge and wisdom. Move any Merlin transformation into Madame Mim's realm to a new location. Okay. I don't really know. Oh, they go into a separate discard oh, deck. Sorry. They're different. Oh, yeah. I don't right. really know what that does, but mm. okay. And I am done, so then I draw up. Okay. I'm going to move to the dueling ground. I'm going to discard two cards from my hand. Gain an power. And then I fade you. Oh, here we go. I fade you. I'm going to play Prince Philip. When Prince Philip is, fade, is played, he may discard all allies from his location. <gasps> Goodbye, Raven. No. Bye-bye, Raven. How sad. And then I draw two cards. Interesting. <laughs> that artwork was great. I do like that they use a lot of artwork from the films. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's like stills, but it's almost like they've taken stills of the film and then actually got someone to like paint them. Just up them. Yeah, just it. like obviously you haven't got someone to paint them because oh, it just takes a lot of time and money. But that's what it looks like. It almost looks like painted pictures you could have on your wall. And it is really, really pretty. Yes. Like Prince Philip is like badass. Yeah. Big old shield. Big old shield. Yeah, it is my turn. Right. I will go down here. To King Stephen's Castle. One power. I will play for three. <laughs> two, three. My Savage Goon. Oh no, a Savage Goon. Which is a power of four, which means I don't have. Um, it has no additional power. Can't beat him yet. Um. I cannot vanquish. New. Well, you could. You could vanquish King Hubert. No, I can't because he's also in two. No? He's got oh, is he here at his location? Okay. Yes. I thought he was across the board. No, man. No. But you can fate me. I can fate you. God damn, that's what I'm going to do. God damn it, I'm willing to fate for it. I'm willing to fate for it, fate for it. Okay. Do all your transformations have this? Uh, yes. Oh, okay. Mm. I believe. Uh, yes. Okay. Well, let's, let's just be fun and play Bird Arthur. Madam Mim discards her hand and draws two cards. Well. What? So you only have two cards to play with the next round. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, that's me done. No. Right. Well, that's kind of ruined my day. Um, <laughs> I'm a villain. All right, I'm going to go here. I'm going to play, gain two power, but I'll only take one of them because I'm going to play Rattlesnake Mim to the dueling ground, because why not? Uh, I'll put him in the woods. I will move Fox Mim to the dueling ground, and I will move Crab Merlin. Hey, Jesse CG is raiding with some viewers, with some friends. Hi, everybody. Welcome along. Raid, 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 raid. Welcome to the Disney raid. Whoop, 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 whoop. 
Howdy friends, it has been a while. We have not been streaming for a little while, but that's... Uh, We've been off for so long. We just haven't done stuff. Um, how well, are you guys? Yeah. What, were you, what were you up to, Jess? That is my turn, I think. I've played a card, I've moved stuff around, I'm getting power, I'm drawing up. Because... Mim. Mim, 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 mim. Hmm, okay. Hmm. How y'all doing, Raiders? How y'all doing? How y'all day been? Welcome to Villainous. Um, I'm Maleficent, that is Madam Mim. I know we look a lot better in person, right? Oh, you're playing a digital puzzle game titled Call the Sea. Oh, awesome. Puzzle game. Or it does like a puzzle game. Puzzle game. That's There's cool. a lot of puzzle games that I started and never finished. Such yeah. a title of my life, really. Hmm. <laughs> anyway, right, I need to move. I don't have the raven because you've got rid of him, girl. <laughs> um... Gosh, I only have like one. Where's my other vanquish actions? Nowhere. I've only got one spot that has a vanquish. Is that yeah, right? Yeah, that's pretty much. I mean, you can't compare it to yours because you don't have any on it. Okay. Uh, oh, thank, right, thanks, don't... Jess. Thanks for reading and uh, enjoy your screen break. Time away with the eye. Rest the eyes a little bit. Have a sleep. Have a good sleep. <laughs> have a nap. Thank you for bit. Thank you for coming. See you later. Uh, okay. 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 Okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna come here. Yes. Get one power. Go to the Forbidden Mountains. Yeah, I like the Forbidden Mountains. You do. I can then. Um, I can then move my. I mean. I mean. Uh, <laughs> So I'm not going to move. Actually, no, no, I will move. I will move. So this guy is now two, a four, so that is a six. So I can use a defeat, but not yet because I don't have a vanquish action. So that's fine. So I've got a power. I've moved card. I will play. Hey, Panda Angel. How's it going? Hi. No raids. No, it's no, no, it's from it's Panda was over on the. Oh. Uh, hey, Panda, how's it going? That's okay. Got um, some evil then... villains athwart him. Hmm, that could be handy. No, okay, yeah, sure. I'll pay one, and I will go. I will play the staff. If Maleficent is at this location, the cost to play an effect or curse is reduced by one power. Ooh. Where would I like to go? Um, let's. Oh, let's pop it here in the Forbidden Mountains because it seems kind of. What do you reckon, cool. Panda Angel? Who was going to win this fight between Madame Mim and Maleficent? Oh, it's all the M's, isn't it? Madame Mim, Maleficent, and Merlin. Why do you think I could get in my M's or Mother? Okay, I've done that, 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 and I will fight you. Mm-hmm. What? Uh, uh. Yeah, this deck is going to go very quickly. Yeah, you can get shuffled over. I don't think this would possibly harm or be good for you more than me. So that one was draw a transformation and put and swap it out with the other transformation. But seeing as you don't have the thing that, uh, as far as I know, that can defeat the crab, the likelihood of picking out something else that these two already have is too high. That's fair. So instead, I'm going to go for knowledge and wisdom again, and I can move the Merlin transformation to. Any spot in the location, so we're going to move there because it's going to slide away. More power, yeah. Crap, 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 crap. And that is me done. Of course, the crab looks like Sebastian. No, he doesn't. <laughs> Sebastian, well, one, Sebastian's red, two, he doesn't have a mustache, three, he doesn't wear little glasses. But he's a crab. <laughs> That's it. I think they just got the same. He looks like the real crab in the new. Little Mermaid, I mean, that... That's terrifying. That is terrifying. That's nightmare fuel. I mean, let's be fair, though. The cartoon, when you look at it... Um, the head was not a crab. Really, what were they desi- What were they designing? 
answer in the answer on the postcard, please. And I draw. Alright, I am uh, moving to the dueling ground. I'm gaining a power. We can discard a card or two. I'm going to get rid of. I'm not cheating again. Because <laughs> I'm not cheating. I'm not cheating. And, and then I fate you. Yay! We get some solid fates out this time. I'm going to play a Merryweather. Merryweather. Curses cannot be played to Merryweather's location. Ooh, nice. 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 Alright, that's my turn and a draw a card. And you draw a card. A draw a card. Turn down for what? Turn down for a what? Mm. Oh, it's kind of like two. I, can't, I mean, I can't do anything much at the moment, so let's just go here. No, wait, I was that. I was that. You were. I was that. And um, go here. Get three. One, two. As you gain three power, I activate my trap card. No, yeah. I play my condition card. So condition cards are cards that can be played when a certain thing is triggered. In this instance, it is big as a house. During their turn, another player gains two or more power. I may play big as a house and gain two power. Yay. So I just get a little bit more power on my turn. And it means I've got... Four. It does mean I've got one fewer cards to play on my turn, but I'm not playing that many cards, really. So, you know. I guess I'll live with it. And then I will play um What will you play, my love? I will play a Sinister Goon for two. I'm loving these goons. And then Sinister Goon gets a plus one to strength if there are any curses at his location. You've not had any mentioned. curses yet. No. You just not drawn them and you just not played them yet. I'll never tell. Mm. Um, and that is me done because I could only take two actions this time. Cool. Right, I'm going to move across back to the woods and pay two power to play Rhinoceros Merlin. Oh, look, there, there the she is. The Mim. Yeah. There she is. Rhino Mim uses her vanquish action to destroy Crab Merlin. And then I get a new hero out, which is... Rabbit Merlin, who can be defeated by Fox Mim. Oh, look at that. I will use Rattlesnake Mim to defeat, to vanquish, fo uh, use Fox Mim to vanquish Rabbit Mim. Goodness me. To be fair, I knew that was coming because I set that up uh, okay. ages ago. But now I bring out Turtle Merlin. Crocodile. Mim. Which I need Crocodile Mim. But now I have uncovered the location here, which gives me an extra two power. I can move a person left or right I do not wish to do that but I do wish to face you Yay! I will play Flora oh crikey Flora's ability is when Maleficent is played Maleficent must reveal her hand until Flora is defeated Maleficent must play with her Jeez. hand revealed oh hey it's a curse oh hey it's two curses it's the same curse twice can you guys see? You guys, you can't see that. Okay, hold on. Ah! It doesn't matter. We we know it's there. We can just slide everything up. Yeah, let's just slidey, 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 slidey. Well, if Luke gets to see it, then really all she needs to. So I have two malices and two forest of thorns, which is just fantastic. You realize you could have. Um, Actually, were I the loser's strength of four? Nope, they were only strength of two. Yeah, right. I know. I was keeping an eye out for it. My apologies. Carry on with your day. Yep. It's your turn. I have drawn back up. I know. We also have Tilly under the table, who is just quite happy having a snoozle. Well, I'm going to have to start vanquishing people. So, um, at this moment in time, all I could... The only person I can vanquish is King Hubert, so let's go. So, vanquish King Let's go. Hubert. Carry Oh. On this point, I'm going to play a Sporting Chance. Great. If a player during their turn performs a Vanquish action, you may play a Sporting Chance. Choose any card from your discard pile and put it into your hand. 
Let's take this card. Ha-ha. And just because I can and why not, I'm going to play the curse. the curse. Forest of Thorns. The Forest of Thorns. So that is one quarter of my objective done. So here it goes. So the Forest of Thorns. You can only play heroes with a strength of four or more to this location. But when you do, the curse goes away. Interesting. Okie dokie. Draw yourself a curve and let's see. Let's see what it is. Is it Ha-cha! a curve? No, it's, it's a goon. Sinister goon again. So many sinister goons. That's all right. Okie dokie. I am going to go to the swamp. In the swamp. I'm giving myself a power. I get to play two cards. That's what I'm trying to go away. Uh, I am going to play Crocodile Mim. Where Turtle Merlin is. It cost me two power. And then I'm going to play a Wizard's Jewel. I get to draw the top card from Merlin's Transformation deck and play it to the Dueling Grounds. So I now have Mouse Merlin. Who can be defeated by Rattlesnake or Tiger Mim. So I have those guys in play. And then, can I dis- I could discard a card to get some extras, but <coughs> I will not. I will just draw up, and I will end. <laughs> I have four more to defeat. Yeah, I know, which is a bit worrying. <laughs> Alright, it is your turn, dear heart. I'm going to go here, and I'm going to discard these two, because... Yeah, my... Like, you do not have people higher than four. I don't think I do. I think the... I think the my, goat was the I highest think the goat so was the far. highest one, yeah. I think even walrus is a uh, three. And the thing is, I could have, like, the same curse on each part of the, my board. It doesn't have to be different, three different curses. That is true. I think. Um, right, so I've discarded... Uh, I've gained two power... Um, I will play um, I will move um, I will move the Savage Coon to Merryweather's mm-hmm. position because Need to take her out. I like how she's more powerful than Flora. Flora will be very annoyed. So I've discarded power, moved. Are you getting two power, did you? Big as a house! Oh, for goodness sake. Are you getting two power? She's, um, she's Trixie, is Madame Lim. Mm. She's Trixie. And then I could just play another one and just whack this curse out, because why not? Why not? Yeah. Um, yeah, that's fair. Yeah. All right. Oh, I could have played him. I'm like, nah, nah. It's don't fine. matter. Right. I'm done here. Right, so. Tyranny! During their turn, if another player has three or more allies in their realm, hmm. you don't have allies. Hmm. The transformations are considered allies oh, for the purposes okay. of your cards. You may play Tyranny. Draw three cards in your hand and discard any three cards. Oh, interesting. Another savage goon. Get a lot of goons. And another sinister goon. Awesome. All the goons. It's the goonies. Uh, 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 uh. I'm going to... You're so funny. I am. That's why you love me. Mm-hmm. I'm going to go here. I'm going to gain myself two power. Yeah, I will. I'm going to play... I'm going to pay two power. to let you get your transformation out and play Elephant Mim. I now have three, so you could... Yay! Tyranny! Draw three cards. One, two, see what you three. Get. Ooh, three curses. Uh-oh. Um... What? It's so much power, though. <laughs> yeah, I know. Although, I actually, mean... well, you could do it in two turns. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, you no. just said that now. I wouldn't have even thought about that. Oh no! I mean, yeah, I could. Uh oh. <laughs> oh my! Oh my hubris! But I need to get rid of her. Oh yes, that's true. I need to get rid of her. So 
three turns then. Yeah. Ah, oh, my hubris, it hurts less. <laughs> That's fair, get rid of the goons. And then, heroes can't be placed. Can't find a move to this location. E boy. Let's keep. Ooh, no, moved moved to this, this location does not count as played to this location. Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, yeah, it says in there. Okay. Oh boy. Can I move to this location? I'll narrow the door. Meanwhile, whilst we're doing that, I'm going to move Rattlesnake Mim and Mouse Merlin. Oh, no way. I had four to begin with. No, you had three because you played a condition card. Yeah. Uh, I have moved Mouse Merlin and Rattlesnake Mim to this, but now I've gained a Vanquish action with Rattlesnake Mim, who will eat Mouse Merlin. Means I get a new transformation card. I've got Walrus, <laughs> which means I have pretty much everything. I can defeat those two on my turn. But. I'm surprised you can do. Multiples. Multiples. Well, I get it's because they, it get, they each gain a Vanquish action. I don't know. I may have been playing this wrong. It's, it's almost. <laughs> it just seems a bit because I would have thought we've always done that. If you like, you activate. You mm-hmm. can only do one. Yeah, that's, that's how the activate action works. Yeah. but this isn't an activate action. Oh, we're going to the rule books, lads. To the rule rules. books. To the rules. This is, welcome to fascinating rule time. Mm. Doesn't that? Let's go through this again. Once. Right. Perform actions. Perform actions. See types of actions on the same page. Vanquish. Each each of the her transformations adds a vanquish action to her location. Defeat one hero at any location in your round by using one or more allies that are already at the same location as the hero. <coughs> each ally and hero has a strength which may be modified. To vanquish the hero, discard the ally. Discard the hero. Okay, uh, it's not so you can't do because it's t- it's technically two separate actions because each one gives them a vanquish action. Yeah, I'm just like separate because you would argue that if you went to the activate spot, you could activate multiple different. Well, no, because the activate action says you can only activate activate one, one card. Ally, ally. Whereas yeah. it's whereas if you look at like uh, one of your spots that has play two cards, it has the two has two play card icons, so you can do it twice. This gives them each gives them a vanquish action. Uh, okay, I just think that's it's yeah. hella strong. It is hella strong. Yeah, especially as like you've only got. One more to do. I've still got to defeat them, and I need to get them out. I... Yeah. Hmm. Are you done? Uh, yes, I've drawn that. Okay, well, I'll go over here. I will fight Mary Weather. I do. I beat her. Ha 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 ha. Mo ha ha ha. Me he he he. Bye bye. Uh, which gets me everything else back. So then I get a power. Okay. I would then like to play a card. I can't, I don't have enough power. Um, no, I can't. Well, I can't actually play anything. Well, great. But I will fake you. I mean, this is where things might get problematic for me. You say that. So th- to win, this has to be empty. Yes. Well, no, I have to have defeated all of them. So I have to defeat all three of them that are left. Yeah, so... And that this, needs to be empty. Yeah, so this needs to be... In order to have defeated them all, it needs to be empty. Yes, but, and not in my room. 
All right, yeah, okay, that's fine. Cool. In which case, I'm going to play Merlin. Randomly choose one card from the Merlin transformation, discard pile, and put it back into the transformation deck. And then shuffle the transformation deck. All right. It's only going to be two, but... Ooh. It's not the goat. It's the greatest of all time, Merlin. Good. It's very egotistical of him. Okay. Mm. Um, Curses. I am done. Yeah, you are. Yeah. I'm going to make you done. All right, I'm going to move Mim. I'm going to give myself a power. I know. Uh, I am going to start off by doing two vanquish actions. Elephant defeats Horus. Crocodile defeats Turtle. Turtle. Because of course they don't. Because of that happens, both of these come out. I have Mouse and Caterpillar Merlins come into play. So they're both weaker ones. Uh, but in doing that, I don't get. An, I have no other action. The only other action I have left is oh, I have Fate and I have Discard. So I am going to discard these two. I draw two more at the end. And then I fate you! No, not again. Shut poop. Shut poop. Ow! Foo. They're not strong okay. enough to go into your thorns. So I shall put them uh, here. Great. Guards! Guards! I perform a vanquish action to defeat guards. At least two allies must be used. Oh, okay. Not too bad, but I had yeah, two, it was two guards, so I didn't really have an option. Draw and draw. Interesting. Ah. You are up. Remember, applying curses to your location with your staff will cost you one fewer power. Yeah. Mm. Oh, okay, yeah, that's fine. Okay. Oh. I will go here. Okay. Get to power. Mm-hmm. I play. Oh, no, 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 I can't do that. It's the wrong card. Never mind. Carry on with your life. Um. I could have gone there, but then I couldn't. I can. Oh, that was silly because I can't actually play a card when I'm there and get the roof. Reduced effect, so um, that's annoying. Oh, that's fine. Let's move up there. Then. I've got two power. I am then going to move, sure, this curse over to here. Watch out. Does it matter? Doesn't bloody matter. Why am I doing that? Goodness me. <laughs> Um, sure, I'll just play, pay three. One, two, three. And curse. Yeah, just curse dreamless sleep. Sure, just curse the forbidden mountains. So that curse goes away when an ally is played to that location. Mm-hmm. But it's fine because I can still play a curse to there even with Flora there, so it doesn't matter. Funny enough, I can I can win if there's still heroes in my realm. Yes, so... you just need to place one more curse. Excuse <laughs> me. And then start my next turn. Ah, uh, yes, you have yeah, to start, I have to start, start my turn okay. with the curses. Sorry. So, so you're saying there's a chance. I got my power. I didn't move anything. Do I want to move anything? Hmm. Nah. Um, power didn't move. Played. Did I discard? Uh, no, you had a at the start of your oh, turn. Oh, I had you three had, at the start of my turn. You did because you had yeah. a tyranny card. I will discard the savage goon sure. because might as well. Or do I? Because um, he might fake me, and then something might come out that says you have to defeat. I'm going to keep it, <laughs> and then okay, I'm done. Then I'll draw. Oh, more green fire. Oh, the spinning wheel. If a 
hero is defeated at this location, gain power equal to the hero's strength minus one. Okay. There. It's too late. I am going to... I, need to, I have to go to a position where I can fake you. So I'm going to go here. I gain two power. Whoop, whoop. Oh, your fake card. Definitely shuffling. Oh, yeah. I will play... I make, I'll make. i make the rules! Which means I can defeat what? any Merlin transformation in my realm. So I'm going to defeat Mouse Merlin, because I know that the... What? I know. I know. It cost me four power, though. I say that. You've got tons of power. Oh, because I've not been doing anything else. Um... I can't play any other cards. I haven't got anything else to move, so I fake you. I'm going to play King Stefan. Oh, no. Which means this curse... <laughs> I'm... Oh, right, yeah. Because when I curse, uh, hero is played to that location, and his strength is four. Uh, when King Stefan is played, you may move Maleficent to any location. I'm going to move her here. Great! A draw. It is your turn. Oh, oh. oh dear. Help me, friends. I'm in trouble. I'm in less trouble now, but I am still in trouble. Mm -hmm. Because I need Chicken Mim to defeat Caterpillar Merlin. And cluck, cluck. I'm just going to fake you because I need to try and slow you down. That's fair. Discard your hand and draw two cards. That was very good because I had a card that let me draw a card back into my hand. Good. Good, good, good. All right. It's my turn. But I will move here and we're getting two power. And unfortunately, the card I picked up was I'll make the rules. With that, it defeats Caterpillar Merlin. Oh. <sighs> Woo! That was close. Wow! You say that? That was cl that was very close. You could have you could have done it if I hadn't drawn King Stefan. Because what was your other card in your fate deck? Aurora. Uh, well, okay. Yeah, it would have. It was going to be pretty close. Mm. I mean, I would have had to have still taken two more turns. Yeah. That's tough. That was a, that's a that's an interesting matchup. That mim is deceptively tricky. Oh dear. Mm. We're pulling her face. No, I'm just I don't know. Her fate deck is not good. Oh no, her I, fate deck is terrible. I would say her like fate moving, deck is not I, the only the only benefit to moving transformations around is in it? the realm is if I already have them in play and yeah. I haven't been able to activate them that turn. Discard transformation. Yeah. That would have been useful. I don't think you ever picked that up in the right time. But there's, yeah, it's just like, it's difficult. There's no allies and there's no heroes. So the thing is, I've got nothing that is constantly stopping you. Yeah. Because you want transformations out. I want the transformations out, out yeah. You, there's nothing to block, really. And the fact that you've been given three down here. I've got, yeah. So, they're, they're relatively weak, though. Like, I mean, admittedly, two fate actions... Two discard actions, gaining some power, playing cards, moving cards. This Madam's Cottage is a strong location because if you just manoeuvred like uh, over here, I can just bring them together in the middle. Yeah. So you kind of need them to be as far away from each other as possible. It's an interesting character to play as. The interesting character to play is I can see that it is not necessarily a fun one to play against. No, because it plays completely. I would say completely differently, but like it's, it, there's there's no allies, there's no heroes, mm. there's not there's n not real point in fating me unless your board is completely covered. But the fact that every single one of your transformations has a vanquish action yeah, it makes it very strong. That is, I think that's. 
too much. It could it could be a misinterpretation of how it's written. To be fair, so we may have to look that one up afterwards and come yeah, back. Yeah, because the way the way that I the way that we read that is kind of just because if you if you had just one vanquish thing, that would keep. I think that would keep you in time with everyone else. Yeah, I think being able to use. I think maybe there needs to be. I don't know if it's just a clarification of opponents can I mean, move. Things can move. Must defeat them with the specific transformations. Unless the specific, unless the specifics of it is that it's supposed to be that the vanquish action on, say, the tiger has to be used to def- or the elephant has to be used to. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's not. These are just like the general instructions, aren't they? Yeah. Oh look, they've got um, they've got oh, so I can tell you what everyone gets in yes. all the villainous ones. Whilst you're doing that, would you like to play another round with different heroes? Maybe. Maybe. Thanks, put me on stream. Put the pressure on me on stream to play a game. What was the pressure? In the way, anyway. In this base box, I think I said, uh, the worst takes it all. You will get Ursula, Maleficent, Captain Hook, Jafar, Preach and the Queen of Hearts. Then, uh, Wicked to the Core, you get the Evil Queen, Dr. Facilier and Hades. Evil comes prepared. You get Scar, Yzma and Rattigan. I played Rattigan, that was good fun. And then Perfectly Wretched, Includes Cruella de Vil, Pete. <laughs> yep, Pete. Who's Pete? Pete. Oh, Pete. Steamboat, Steamboat Willie Pete. Yeah. Pete, Pete. And Mother Gothel. Won it. Tangled is one of your favourites. And then Despicable Plots is Gaston, Lady Tremaine, and the Horned King. What a throwback. Yeah, it's a good, it's a good trilogy, that one. Uh, and then obviously, that, I mean, obviously, with this one, you get... Syndrome, Lotso, and Modem. Because, as we know, of course, no one fights like Gaston. No one wins Gaston like Gaston. Da 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 da. Love a bit of Gaston. Yeah. Anyway. I'm especially good at this factor rating. My what a guy that Gaston. Get fun. What do you reckon? Do you want to try do another one? You can do. Yes. Yeah. Do you want to play out of the core set or do you want to grab one of the others? I'm happy to play. I was going to. Um, I might play as uh, Captain Hook. Captain Hook? All right. Yeah. Have the hook. Yeah, I do, I love that this is. I mean, it, Villainous didn't. I called it initially when it, when we first played it, and then it's kind of like, eh, it's okay. I really warmed to it quite recently for some yeah. reason. Villainous in general, I really yeah. warmed to it. Yeah. Once we've got an idea, when we first played, it was quite like you were kind of like, what the hell do I do? But then you realise everything that you need to do is on the cards. So you might be reading the little instruction booklet on your character and you might be like well how do I get that card uh, what what does what does this mm. card do blah, blah, blah. actually as soon as you pick up that card you know you know what you need to do because it, it is all there so sometimes the instructions can seem a bit like oh that's Thought. a bit much but... uh, we tried the Marvel version we haven't played the Star Wars version and to be honest I have no interest in trying the Star Wars version because I don't like Star Wars you don't like Star Wars and yeah we tried the Marvel one it was fine as long as no one played as Thanos. Yeah, Thanos. I, I there think we, was we too also, much I think we also had, we also had the problem of we played. I'm going to play as Prince John. Um, we had the issue. I think <laughs> we played it. Assume, we went straight into it, assuming that it was going to be identical to the base game, uh, to Disney Villainous, and it isn't because um, there's only a single fake deck. Which is sort of shared with different ones. However, I I wish I I probably should have tried it again. We sold it. Um, if it's in a cafe at some point, I might try it again, uh, just to <coughs> to see uh, if I understand it a little bit better. Because there's been some <coughs> interesting things have been released. Like the most recent expansion they did had uh, Doc Ock, Titania, and. <coughs> Mm, excuse me. Someone else. But they also have like Venom. I'm a big fan of Spider Man. Spider Man's one of my favourite yep. Marvel characters. Um, and it's just some it's just some fun stuff. 
Um, speaking of, speaking of Spider-Man and all the flipping flip and all and uh, sort of favourite characters coming in, I don't know if I told you this, there's a new unmatched Marvel unmatched set that has Spider-Man I in saw. it. I saw, and part, um, and initially I was like, oh, that's so cool. And the other part of me was, oh, he's going to buy it, isn't he? Yes, yes, I am. We've barely played any of the others. Well, that's on you. We've literally got the one with the raptors in it, and have you played it? We could play it now. No. We've got time have to play it now. Have you played it? No. We could play we it now. We need to play all of them first before we buy more. Go, go get them. We will play them right now. We've got time. No. <laughs> There is no hand limit. There is no hand limit. Mm-hmm. All right. Prince John versus Captain Hook. Mm-hmm. Well, that's good. That gets a bit shiny, so I'm going to put you back over there, then, in this box. Lots of Madden Mim are recommended for new players, and Syndrome is recommended for experienced players. Well, that's all they got to say about that one. <laughs> well, fair enough. Alrighty, Prince John of Robin Hood Infamy versus Captain Hook from Peter Pan. Uh, so. Prince John, his objective is to start my turn with at least 20 power. But one of the things about in my fate deck is there are the many men, the many men, the many merry men who are uh, trying to steal power away from me. Mm-hmm. Which is a bit of an issue. And you are playing as Cat and Hook. Ah, uh, that doesn't mean you need the lock token where you put that. We, Hangman's Tree is locked, and I need to defeat Peter Pan at the Jolly Roger. Alrighty, that's it. Too many cards. So I'll put this one back in the middle of my deck. Mm. Alrighty, who do I want to play? Okay. These little pamphlets are handy though because it tells you everything that you need to do, what cards to look for, and no one should be reading it. Like, this is yours. Admittedly, when you've played them all, you kind of know what you've got to do. But... Yes. We've got some fun stuff to do here. Prince John is all about trapping his hero, trapping heroes in a way where they're not going to cause any problems. Oh, if you find Peter Pan, you must play him. Yes. Even if a hangman's tree mm. is locked, and he must be played to the hangman's tree. Would you like to go first this time? Yeah, please. Um, I'll tell you what, this purple, that's uh, one of our wedding colours. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that, that purple hook. It is. And the red as well. And the red, yeah. Who doesn't want to see a wedding bouquet that's made out of Captain Hook? <laughs> it's Ooh. just his big feather. And his hook. And his hook. Yeah, there's going to be a dragon in there. It's going to be a... Yeah. No, it's not going to be a hook. It is going to be a dragon. It's not going to be a hook. Uh, yeah. Okay then. Right then. Let's go. We. Me first. It's you. It's me. Hi. I'm the problem. It's me. What? Uh, okay then. Mm. Hmm? Sorry, Tills. Stop licking your foot. No, no lick. Stop licking. Yes, all right. I'll strangle chin. Good girl. I'll just, be, I'll just be down here for a second here, chat. Yeah. Just uh, stroking the dog. That's not a euphemism. Giving the fur baby yeah, little hat pats. Okay. Let's go here and get me some power. What? Power? How dare Three you? Three power. That's my whole thing. Three power. Well, I'm not moving, but I can play two cards. And sure, let's play Worthy Opponent. I gain two power. Nice. Yay. And I reveal cards from the top of my fate deck until I reveal a hero. I play that hero and discard the rest. Oh, look, there's Tinkerbell. Oh, when Tinkerbell is played, you may discard one ally from a location. Oh, that's fine. Um, 
So where is this going to affect you the least? Where is it going to affect me least? Probably where you are, actually. Oh, well, yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, hey, Tink. Discard that. So we saw Tink Bell and Captain Hook at uh, Disney World. We did. And technically, I can say I've played that one, so I can play another one if I want. Sure. Do that. Do that thing. Um. Everyone to help me get large. I will then spend three, and I will. <laughs> Pirate brute. <laughs> His lovely Jolly Roger tattoo. Yeah. And that's me done. It's the campest pirate I've ever met. Not than Smee. Smee's not camp. Mm. He's got a bit of a pie voice, but he's not camp. I mean, you've not seen Captain Jack Sparrow, have you? Jesus. Mm. He's camp. I did not I did not say Smee was the campest pirate. Although he's... Uh, pirate brute's pretty camp pirate. He's... Play your goddamn Prince John. Ain't nothing wrong with it. All right, I'm going to gain three power with Prince John, the baby. I want to get straw up. You do. Uh, I will pay my three. Mm. I'm going to pay two power to play Sir Hiss. If Prince John is at Sir Hiss's location, we perform one action that is covered by a hero at that location. Mm-hmm. And then I will discard napping. There was end my cancer. Wow. Ha ha. Ha ha. Okay. Mattern. Mm. Okay. I'm going to go down here and mm. get one power. Shaboop. I'm going to vanquish Tinkerbell. That's me. Don't you believe in fairies? I do, and I believe that I'm going to vanquish her. <clears throat> Um, I will then play worthy opponent again and gain two power. Well, and I will reveal my death until I find a hero. Oh, look, it's Peter! Well, exactly that's... what I wanted. Jeez, he's strong. Eight. Yep. Uh, that's fine. Well, someone and then, didn't so... shuffle her fate deck very well. I did. Me? I didn't shuffle her fate yeah, deck very okay. well. <laughs> so, Vanquish, I got a power. I played. And discard. Mm. Discard that one because I don't have any allies out at the moment. Mm. Oh. Get rid of that one because really I found the hero that I want. So, yeah, and I'm done here. All right. I will cry. Oh uh, dear. I will go over to Sherwood Forest. I've given myself one power. I'm going to play Reward. Oh, I'm going to play a Warrant for one power. Uh, the Warrant is I gain two power each time a hero is played to this location. Huh? Warrant. I gain two power oh. each time a hero is played to Friar Tuck's Church. Interesting. Uh, do I want to discard a card? No, I do not. I do, however, want to fate you in the face. Whoa! That's mean. Very mean. I will play Pixie Dust. Pixie on, Dust! Onto Pan. He gains a plus two. Oh, damn. So Pan now has a strength of ten. Whoa! Oh, boy. That is a lot. That's me done. You're up. Huzzah! One, two, three, four, one. You have now the eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes. I play greed. Oh. During the turn, if another player has six or more power, you may play greed to gain three power. Wow. Well. Because it's Prince John. Yeah. And then I may. And then I'm going to play. The Neverland map which unlocks the hangman's tree! (laughs) But it doesn't get discarded, it just gets played out. Oh, yeah. And then when you play an item, you may discard Neverland map instead of paying the item's cost. I mean, I'm in trouble. I'm just going to go here. I think it has to go here because that location is locked until you played it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it doesn't matter. But yeah, 
that is fine. Well, it's the problem. Take. Um. I suppose you could move it. Right? I'm technically. Yeah, I don't know. Sorry, Tilly. So got my three. You played a card. Played und card. Und card. Und card, yeah. This is good. Oh yeah. I'm sorry, I'm onto it. Onto six now for some reason. And then I will pay two to get this action to move this location. Gains the move hero action. Uh oh. Oh. Let's go. Let's go here because I'll be fating you a fair bit anyway. I imagine so. Because you're mean. I am mean. Why you I am be also done. Why are you going to be so mean? Mean. Alright, I'm going to go mean. across to jail. Draw. No, actually, I'm going to go to Nottingham. I'm going to gain a single power. I am going to play. Trigger to Nottingham. Trigger! Cost me two power. Okay. All allies, all other allies at Trigger's location get minus one strength, but he has a strength of four. Oh. And then I get to Afatio. I am going to play the Lost Boys. Yay. So the oh, Lost Boys must be defeated okay. by two allies. Okay. Because they are Lost Boys. Okay. And there are many of them. Mm-hmm. Why you gotta be so mean? Mean, mean, mean. Eat your turn. It is my turn. Um. So when he says defeat Peter Pan and Johnny Roger, I don't need to be there. Just allies need to defeat him there. Yes. Yeah. Although as it happens, your vanquish action is at the Johnny yeah, Roger. That's so. Fine. Yeah. That, yeah. That makes sense actually. Makes semantic sense. That makes. Mm. Um. Okay. Well. Mm, no, I want to start fating you. So that's fate. Fate you. Pod. Me. Ah, I can't do that. Can't do that either. Oh, I can't do either. They both require heroes. Ooh. That's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. The clever disguise and seeing from the rich. That is. Unlucky. It is. Do you wish to discard any cards? Got that one and that one. Yeah. Okay. You all done? Um, yes, and I'll draw back up to right. four. I shall God's sake. move to the jail. I'm going to gain three power and then pay three power immediately to play Rhino Guards. So I've just got some Rhino Guards hanging out here, doing Rhino Guard things. Hanging out. I'm going to discard a second copy of Rhino Guard and then I'm going to join my turn. Cool, 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 cool. Oh, yep. dear. oh wait, I could have moved. Ah, oh, you can do it now. It's fine. Come on. Your turn. Yay. Um, oh, I can. Ah. Uh... No, right? no, ignore me. Okay. So anyway, um, Jazz, she's not here. So yeah. <laughs> I will go down here. I will get to Bawa. The Bawa. The Bawa. Um, I'll move Peter again. What? We. Join the Lost Boys. Um, play, play, play. Sure, I'll pay two power to play Cannon! And this location gains a vanquish action. Nice. Um, and then I will fit you. Oh no! Let's hope I actually get a hero. That is the face of someone. Can't, can't, the exactly same, same, so I can do this. Um, Skippy! Skippy, wolf archers cannot be used to defeat Skippy. Um, let's go here. Stop you fating me. But he can be easily destroyed. He's just the back attraction there. <laughs> Oh, 
was just thinking it will hide the f- it will dispel the fate from me, but then you go to vanquish him immediately. So. Or you could vanquish him anyway. That's it. But in there is no danger. Danger sure. at the moment anyway. Um Is that me done? Is that mm-hmm. me done? Is that me that's me done. That you done. We're done here. Ooh. Alright, I'm going to move across here. I will gain two power. I'm going to pay beautiful, lovely taxes. I gain power for each hero in my realm. And then I will play Set a Trap. I can move an ally from any... Move an ally to any location and then perform a vanquish action. Wow. Rhino Guards. Smite Skippy. Smite Skippy. Yes. Means he is defeated. Huzzah. Uh, was that worth it? Probably not, but that's okay. I did things. So I get to draw two cards, and that is my turn. I'm going to need to fade you at some point. Ooh. Okay. I'm going to go... I'm going to go over here, mm. only because I'm going to get rid of these two. Okay. And then I will fate you. Okay. Yay, more fating! Oh. You also wow. have, don't forget you have your ingenious device. Oh yeah, and I can move Peter to the Jolly Roger, which is where I want to beat his ass. Um, okay, okay. 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 Panda, if you're still there, did I see that you're going to be playing uh, Let's Go to Japan soon? Baby, um, um, hop, 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 Let's go there, so then one, two, three, four. Oh, strength of five! Yeah! I'm sad now. Oh, I'm sorry. No, you're not. No, I'm not. Um, wow. and that's me again. Wow. Oh, and I can move Peter again. Whee! Alright. So now I've just got to find some people to destroy him. Yep. Alright, I'm going to move across here and gain our power. And then play a card. I'm going to play the Wolf Archers for two power. Uh, I could do a Vanquish action, but I can't. They can be used to attack adjacent. In fact, I'm going to put them over where Sir Hit is, because they can be used to shoot in different locations. So I'm just going to put them here for now. Oh, I'm going to... Sorry, I'm going to play Cunning. During their turn, if another player has an ally with a strength of four or more in their realm, you may play Cunning and play an ally from your hand for free. Nice. Uh-oh. Wee. Boarding party. Nice. When performing a vanquish action, boarding party may be used to defeat a hero at their location or at an adjacent... Adjacent. Adjacent. Unlocked location. Okay, I have drawn power. I have played a card. I cannot vanquish, so I must... Fate you. Fate! Fate more. Well, I guess the logical place to put is... Wendy! Uh... All of the heroes and Captain Hop's around get... What? So he's got like strength. 11? He's got 11. Crikey! And then that's got 5. That's my turn. That is my turn. Okie dokie. Don't you worry, you're a pretty little mind. People throw rocks at things that shine oh, as Miss Love. Did I draw? Uh, you played Cunning, which meant you. Cunning? But why do I only have two left? Because you played Cunning, which let you play Boarding Party. Oh, yes, I've only got two left. Um. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
Okay, let's just go here and I'll get three more power. Three more power. <coughs> move, can't move anything. However, I will play a card and swap out the Leverland, 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 the Neverland map yes. to play this item for free. Which is the cutlass. When a cutlass is played, it gets a plus two strength. Really? So That's a cost of one power. You're going to use the map for that? Okay. <laughs> no. No, I'm not. No. <laughs> no, you know what? No. No, I'm not. I'm just going to pay one power. <laughs> I didn't even pay attention to how much it cost. I just thought, oh, yay. Free, free cutlass. <laughs> there we go. I'm glad I'm an honest so person. So much goddamn sass. Really? You're going to waste that just to play a one power item? Oh my god. Gosh, Laura. What, what are you doing? Why are you doing such a terrible blunder? Oh my god. I mean, do it. You do you, boo. You do but you. Uh, if you you're, do that. You're wrong. <laughs> you're so wrong. So wrong. Anyway, uh, I got three power. Um, yeah, well, played <laughs> one card. <laughs> Can't play another card. Um, do I want to move anything? Do I want to move anything? Do I want to move? Um. Bleh. Nah. I'm oh, alright. Alright. I don't need to really move these anymore. Is me? And then I draw it back up to four. One. Two. Three. Alright. I'm going to move here. Gain two power. Boop, boop. Then I'm going to play the Golden Arrow. I'm going to give, trigger the Golden Arrow. When Golden Arrow is played, attach it to an ally. When that ally is used to defeat a hero, gain two power. Oh. I'm then going to play my other card, which is Set a Trap. I can move an ally to any location and then perform a Vanquish action. So I'm going to move Trigger here. And Trigger is then going to Vanquish uh, Little John with the help of a Wolf Archer, who can attack from adjacency. So six against five... Little John is defeated. I can play Obsession! During their turn, if another player defeats a hero with strength or four, I reveal cards from the top of my fate deck until I reveal a hero. I can either play that hero or I can discard that hero. Yes. Item. Discard the rest, though. Hold on. Perfect. I'm just going to discard them all. Hero, Lost Boys. No. I can defeat that. There discard we go. Them. There Bye bye. Uh, so Trigger and the Wolf Archers are defeated. Defeated as part of the Vanquish action, they are expended. But the Golden Arrow, uh, when that ally is used to defeat a hero, the uh, ally is on, I gain two power. So nice. I have now a sweet, sweet total of eight. I'm nearly halfway there, and I am living on breath <laughs> because. Well, Pam. Yours, in dear. Yours. Gosh, I really need to like. Where are all my allies? Like they're they're all just they're, they're none. Do you want do like, you know what happens? They're all the goons in uh, yeah the in Lefton, deck, yeah, So yeah. you know that happened. Mm -hmm. Okay. Really, if I can get rid of Wendy, then that'd be great. But even they can't do that. So I'm gonna go here, and I'm gonna get rid of. These two. Yeah. And I'm gonna fake you again. Oh no! Oh hi Tilly. And move. Yeah, you know what? Let's move let's just move Wendy here because I can use those two better. Well that's pointless because there's no heroes, but Prince John cannot play effects. Okay, so where is King Richard the Lionheart going? Well, that's rude. Okay, so I can't play effects cards. That's fine. That's okay. That's fine. Oh, yeah. Oh, there we go. All right. I'm going to move to the jail. I'm going to play Warrant and gain three power. So, again, if I were to... So, I basically next gain two. So, that puts me on ten. I am halfway there. Oh, I'm halfway there, <laughs> trying to avoid getting banned. 
Uh, so that is 10 power I have. I play a card, so every time a hero is played third location, I can do things, and I'm going to discard the Rhino Guard. Discard. Discard Rhino Guard. And then I draw two. And that is my turn. What did Pan have? Eleven. Pan has eleven. 11. Okay. And you currently have a. The only ally has four. Four. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm gonna get two power. Oh, there's lots of power over here. How much power do you have now? One, two, three, four, five, six. Greed. Uh-huh. I gain three power. Now I'm thirteen. Whoa. Okay. Two. I'm nearly there. Um, move a. Move a hero. I mean, if I just kind of bundle up them, then that's fine. <laughs> sure. Um, and then play. Yeah, I'll play Pirate Brute, Camp Pirate Brute, because he is not happy with what you said. <laughs> and I'll put him here, so that is a total of eight. That is strong. I need three more. Three more. Three um, more, so I need to do something about can't that. Can't vanquish anyone at the moment. And I will fight you. Sure. We'll play Clever Disguise. When Clever Disguise is played, attach it to a hero. That hero cannot be defeated. At any time, Prince John may pay two power to discard Clever Disguise. Oh, interesting. So I cannot defeat King Richard. Until you get rid of Clever Disguise. So pay two power to get rid of it in order to defeat him. I see. <laughs> well, all right. I'm going to move over here. I'm going to gain a power. I'm going to discard my two effect cards that I can't play. Um, I will play the Wolf Archers to the Jail for two power. That brings me down to twelve. And then I fate Hooky. Hooky Dooky. Hooky Hooky Hook Hook. I will. Mm, I will play TikTok here. If Captain Hook moves to TikTok's location, he must immediately discard his hand. <laughs> oh my god, that's so good. That's really good. So, I just realised. That's so good. <laughs> that's very that's good. That's fantastic. Oh, that's. That's my favourite. Well done. Well done. Oh, that's my favourite thing. Give him a raise. Give him a raise. That is my favourite thing. Anyway, right, that is my turn. I am done. You're right. (laughs) Oh, that's fun. Um. gonna go oh I can't even go there oh yeah it's just I've just realised what you've done there mm. what, what have I done there what have I done oh, mm. I just got this out very good what me or the card very good Thanks. I guess I'm gonna have to go here and I will play my um I've just realised if you have a hero, an ally with the strength of three or more, I mean, I will lose. You've been lucky. <laughs> um, so that's a plus two. So I've got two, four, eight, ten. So I just need one more. Oh boy. And I can vanquish Peter. 
and that's me done. Uh oh. You better hope you fake me and find something. I can't fake you. Ha ha ha. Oh, no, I can't fake you. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, I've made. Oh dear. I can get 15 power. Okay, I'm going to go here. I'm going to gain 3 power. That's up to 15. I have to start my turn with at least 20 power. Eep. Eep. I can discard cards. I'm going to throw away these two because they're not helping me. <sighs> Do I want to play Nutsy? No, I don't. Not at this point. I draw. Okay. Wee. Here. Uh huh. And I will play the swashbuckler, which has a two, which is away. And then I will. Fake you. <laughs> That's fair. No, I will then vanquish Peter Pan. No. I should have played Pixie Dust on Japan instead Bye. of TikTok. Bye, uh, Peter. Well. Peter. <laughs> he should have, because that would have taken me. Admittedly, I would have been able to do it next turn. Yeah, but I would have been. But not necessarily because. Oh yeah, I would have put it on there. Yeah, you blocked off a fa you blocked off a face action, and I could not move King yeah. Richard. Well done, GG. Oh, that was that really was, that was good. Close. Yeah. Admittedly, I got what I needed very, very quickly. You did get yours very, early. very quickly. And you just avoided my. Hey, here's how I can gain power. Things like what am I just going? Oh, I'm just not going to play them there. Yeah, basically. Very easy to avoid. To start with, when you start, when you get them all out, then it's it is very... I, I, I picked up a third. It's a slow burner. I picked up a third. I don't know if he's got uh, a fourth. I don't think he does. No. Yeah. No, uh, crown. Oh, well. mm. But that, dear friends, is Disney Villainous. We have played with uh, four different characters today. We have won one apiece. And that is going to be our show for today. Let me have a look at who is playing at the moment so we can go off and raid into them i believe we're gonna have some friends we can go and over and see loser palooza always a classic oh look smee was right at the bottom smee all right so let me just set up the raid aye aye sir it should be aye aye captain Captain. Uh, Captain. There you go. I have set up the raid, so we've got that ready to go. Ooh. Thanks everyone for being here. We hope you take very good care of yourselves and you have a lovely uh, rest of your week. Enjoy the Easter weekend if, if that you is are something celebrating you celebrate. Easter weekend. If not, enjoy some extra days off work. And if you are working, I applaud you for your bravery and sacrifice. <laughs> I've been there, done that. I honestly, it's. Good job. Good, good job. Yeah, we appreciate it. Um, all right, we're going to go off and raid. That is, why is this not working? Oh, no. What is it doing? I don't know. No. We'll figure it out. We'll figure don't it out. Don't worry, guys. All right, we'll everyone. Over. Thank you very much, everyone, and we will see you... In the next video. In the next one. Take care of yourselves, everyone. Bye-bye. Oh, wait. We forgot to say about game tea. Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh my god, we're bad ambassadors! Oh, we have done poorly. Yeah, if you want to, if you want to go check out Game Tea, you can go to gametea.co.uk forward slash equitalive and uh, check out some wonderful gaming adjacent gear and goods such as candles and stuff. We and are dice travel dice and stuff and t-shirts and cool posters. Yeah, and if you and use the code equitalive, you'll get yourself a 5% off and some of that will come and help us, so it'll be appreciated. But until then, check out Game Tea, go do some wonderful stuff and we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!